And we are underway in Buffalo. Kene Duwagu now out of his end zone. And he'll be stopped right around where he would have been had he gone down to a knee, maybe a yard shy of there at the 24. First play, here's Cousins. And his first look is incomplete. I think he's got to be careful not to force anything into coverage right there. There weren't really any throwing lanes, but the best part for him, he's got second and third down to fall back on. Now a second and ten. Now the first carry for Cam Akers. And this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the 30. A quick burst there, and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game. Cousins from the gun on third. Going underneath, he's got Hawkinson. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Off the play fake, Cousins. And got his man complete. And I think the ball's out. But it looks like one of the DBs has it. is going to be stopped on the return at his own three-yard line. It's not often that we see big plays end in disaster, and we just absolutely saw it right there. They had something really big hooking on that one. Can you, when, you, when you're down near the goal line like that on a big play, do you get maybe a little too careless, a little too desperate for the goal line? I think the last part is exactly right. You get desperate for the goal line, and sometimes you get the ball out of him away from your body, or you're trying to extend to get there, or maybe you're just trying so hard that the ball will come out of your hands. In any event, that's a big opportunity lost. Stephon Diggs off to the races. Stephon Diggs. And all the way home for a Bills touchdown. Stephon Diggs, 97 yards. And the Bills use the early turnover to get on the board first here in this one. And his kick is no good. An inauspicious start here kicking-wise as this one stays a 6-0 game. Now he's back out there to boom this one away, maybe with some frustration after the PAT miss. Nuwangu now from his end zone. And he's up across the 25 and down at the 28. The Minnesota offense about ready to get this next drive underway. Last time out, remember, they fumbled the football. That led to the touchdown. And, Charles, they were in the red zone, so that's a backbreaker. they got to try to pick up the pieces here on this drive. Yeah, and I actually started to do the math here, so be patient with me. 12-point swing is the way I calculate it because not only did they drop the ball in the red zone, they watched the opponent score a touchdown right after that. So their goal, have a drive here and try and get some of those points back. Play fake, Cousins. Oh, going for Jefferson downfield. And that is incomplete. Almost feels like anything you can do, we're going to try and match or do better. We've already seen one touchdown pass from the opposition. They tried to equal it on that throw. Second and 10. They'll run out of the gun with Akers. And he'll get this up past the 45 to the 47. Third and two. They'll try and run for this with Akers. And he's got the first down yardage before being taken down at midfield. They'll go again here with Akers. And not a whole lot of room to operate there on the first down run. He gets maybe three. Yeah, I don't know if it's exactly a win-win, but if you're on offense, you'll take that kind of a run, all right? It was kind of stacked up. 
found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. Flush to his right. And that's going to be incomplete. Uh, that's some good closing speed there defensively because that looked open for a minute. But that's great work with the ball in the air. Never gave up. Converged on his man and broke the play up. Oh, he tried to fit it in on the slant and it's intercepted. And the Bills are going to have great field.